In professional baseball, you hear headlines of walk-offs and no-hitters. But two weeks ago, Texas pitcher Solomon Bates received international attention for a much different reason, being a public announcement about a personal battle off the field that's now allowed him to be his true self on it. KCU 9's Noah Sacco gives us the full count in this week's Sports Spotlight. I'm just looking for that, you know, courage to keep going and keep fighting. Drafted by San Francisco in 2018, Solomon Bates was on a rise through the minor leagues as rapid as his mid-90s fastball. And on August 9th, the USC product revealed a piece of himself he was hiding during his pro baseball tenure, announcing on social media that he was gay, going on to disclose his recent release by the Giants organization of whom were aware of Bates' news since 2019. Kind of surprised me uh, to the point to where I was just like, once they told me, I didn't really say anything. I just like stood there in shock. The only active pro baseball player to come out publicly, the 25-year-old said his decision would draw some praise along with a fair share of criticism. But taking inspiration from David Denson and the NFL's first openly gay player, Carl Nassib, Bates chose to listen to his heart rather than the haters. I did have Carl Nassib reach out. I did have David Denson reach out. They told me that what I'm doing is like courageous. I feel like you never really know when's the right time. It just, it's either you're ready or you're not. If you're not ready, then you know, you're gonna be in a closet for the rest of your life. But if you can actually accept yourself, then it's the right time to do it. After years of weight finally lifted off his shoulders, Solomon had nothing left to hide. But with his agent shopping around for a new team, it was unclear if baseball would be in Bates' future. Until two days later, when a familiar face from Lewis and Clark Park came calling. I said, yeah, I'll take him. And he goes, well, I just got to tell you one thing. And, and he told me, and I don't care either way. I mean, if you can get outs, you get outs. And um, what you do in your own personal time is up to you. Solomon signed with the X's on August 11th, joining the team the next day on the road as his first club since coming out. Thrilled for the opportunity, but wondering how his new teammates would take it. The first week they opened arms, like when I first got here, they all introduced themselves to me, so it was awesome. We got different religion, you know, we got different races, all these things. We're a very accepting clubhouse, and that's also what makes us have a good clubhouse. He's a good arm. If he's going to come in and help us win games, that's great. That's what we want. Hungry to make an impact in his ex's debut, Bates convinced Mongo to give him the ball with a 4-3 lead in the series opener. And ready to prove naysayers wrong, Solomon rose to the challenge, striking out his first six batters through three innings of work in the win. A wave and a miss at a high heater. I was like, I'm ready to show what I'm made of. So he gave me that opportunity. And then out there on the mound, I just, I just had a chip on my shoulder. I was like, Solomon, that might be the most impressive uh, debut with the team I've ever seen. First six batters you face, you came up. That was pretty awesome. Now back in action, Solomon plans to make the most of his opportunity in Sioux City, hoping that his personal and professional journey can be a light for other athletes. It took a lot of guts and fortitude to do what he did. I'm proud of that kid, and you know, I'm proud to be his manager. All while maintaining the dream of a return to affiliated ball, trying to stay on the mound as long as he can. It's my happy place. It's the only place like I want to go to every day. You know, I love the sport with, the, with my heart, with a passion. So I'm just happy to go out there and do what I, what I can do. In Sioux City. Keep shooting for the stars and keep going for what I believe in. Noah Sacco, KC9 Sports.